All right, so we have some big things to talk about today. We just got a bunch of new leaks regarding several upcoming updates in Prodigy, so that that is what we are going to be going over. And these leaks are for the charged levels and a new member jar update that I have not yet talked about in a video. So we're going to be going over all of this in this video. And all of these images that I'm going to be using in this video come from David A's video. So credit goes to him for finding these images and posting the video on that so that I could use these images. Anyway, let's go ahead and start looking at some of these crazy leaks that we got of images. But first, I want to mention that there is a new little thing in game that now shows that if you're at level 100, it shows a green bar and it says max level. We do know that um, you're going to be able to go up past level 100 with charged levels, but those are not in the game yet. So max level is being shown right now for level 100. I think that looks a lot better than just the empty bar that we previously had when you were at level 100. Okay, that's weird. This shouldn't be here. Um, I think my internet's just kind of bad right now. Yeah, I'm not showing up. Just some weird internet problems going on. But anyway, these are some crazy things that have been found. So let's go ahead and talk about the charged levels update that we just got. These are going to be in game very soon. Like, you gotta understand that. It's going to be very, very soon that these charged levels make it into Prodigy. And I'm super excited to find out what they actually are and how they are going to work. We do have more information on how they're going to work today, so I'm going to share some of that. Huh, this 99 bar. What? It's up here. I don't know where it came from because there's no 99 anywhere, but whatever. We're just going to roll with it. Let's talk about some of the updates that we got. So I'm going to start with some text first. This is what has been found, and we know that charged levels are coming very very soon so i will be making a video on that when that happens so keep watch for that it reads charged levels release charged levels starting at level 100 your wizard can power up even more with special charged levels play every four days to keep the charge going so that provides us some information on how these are going to work you've got to like play every four days to keep the charge going like going up i guess and i mean this is going to be insane how high are we going to be able to get i have no idea but i'm super excited to find out members will be able to do this i've talked about this in previous videos and we're just going to have to find out when it releases but we do know quite a bit more on how this is going to work we have some animation pictures for what this can look like I'm just going to put these up here quickly. There are some just spines for the animations that are going to be happening when charged levels occur. So that looks really cool. Can't wait to see those actually in game. And again, this is going to be very soon. So keep watch. And we also have this new look here for the UI of this uh, system looking thing. It shows that wizard with uh, Ruckus and Wick around it that we talked about in a previous video, but now, with, now they are around a, a gold yellow circle of fire, which I think looks absolutely amazing, really cool. And we also see that there is confirmation that the wizard is going to be able to get bonuses with the new leveling up, like more hearts defense and power speed is not shown in here but i assume speed will be included as well in this image we also see a calendar to show like the dates i think for the every four days or something so that'll be in game i guess the swords i have no idea what they're for they could be for like dueling though because that is what store the swords have been used for in the past there's a gold coin, so some of these might involve um, gold. We'll see about that. But again, these look really cool. And I'm super excited to see this in-game. 
And actually, we do have a glitch that has gone around, I guess, today, where some players have the golden circle of fire around the wizard, like, in-game, which is crazy because it shouldn't be there because the charged levels are not yet in Prodigy, but we do have some uh, reports of this glitch, so credit goes to the people who actually posted this. It looks like when you have the charged levels, you're just going to be walking around in Prodigy with this circle of uh, golden fire around you, which I think is going to look very cool, and that'll let other players know that you are a charged level wizard. I guess that may help for if you're trying to, they're trying to battle you or something. So those are the updates that we've gotten for the charged levels system. Again, I am very excited to see how this is going to work in game and I just cannot wait to experience this. But we also have a new member jar update coming. I have not talked about this in a video yet, but the member jar is what gives you the member stars through battles at the end of battles if you knew that opens and you get stars, they're collected, that sort of thing. And you have the member chest that you can open at the end of battles as well. It looks like there's going to be a really cool new update coming to this system because now here's the image that shows the new look for the member jar and it also has items inside of it which are representing the items that you would be getting in game, I guess. So we see stars inside. So that would be the bonus stars that you get for being a member. We see gold coins. Those would be for the gold coins. You get extra gold at the end of battles. And I really wonder what is these gifts are. There's like two different types of gifts inside here. I wonder what they're going to be. I don't think they would be any major items, but we'll have to see. They could definitely be. Who knows? I'm really excited to see this update in-game. We have a nice member symbol on the top of the jar that looks really cool. And here we also have what looks like a wizard watch post, but if it's not, it would probably be like the advertisement for um, being becoming a member. It has the jar opened, and there are the gifts inside, and the different uh, types of items inside are out to the side, so that looks really cool, and we are going to have just a new um, member jar system in-game, hopefully pretty soon. So these are, like, extremely exciting. We have a lot to be looking forward to in Prodigy right now. We have the very soon upcoming charged levels. We have this member jar update. We have the updates to the dual stadium. Those are going to be coming soon. I talked about that in yesterday's video. And we also have season two of the treasure track coming very soon. Keep watch for that when it is released. Hopefully either by the end of this week or the very beginning of next week. We'll see about that. Spring Fest will be this month, hopefully, starting at the end of March, towards the end of March. So, of course, we can look forward to that and be excited about it. And this is just a lot. We've got a lot going on in Prodigy right now, and I think that's great. It's always great to have a lot of new updates to look forward to in-game. So what are your thoughts about all of this? What are your thoughts on charged levels? How do you think they're going to work in game? When do you think they'll be released? What are your thoughts about this new member jar? I think it looks really good. What do you think? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comments.